Dear viewers, in our previous lecture, I've just shown you that how we'll design our beam. Okay, so if I just show you here, for this from design to output, that is the um, tabulated data of beam design, and that was the uh, and here that was the section and elevation view of our beam. Okay, beam cross section. So in our previous lecture, I've just shown you about that. Now, uh, in this lecture, I'm just going to show that how we we'll create BBS bar bending schedule for our all of that beam. Okay, so here I have uh, created all of our here all of our bar bending schedule. Yes, see all of our bar bending schedule we have just created in our previous lecture. But uh, and also if we just come here. And so it's done okay so uh, in this lecture a lecture i'll show you how we'll create bar bending schedule so for bar bending schedule i'll just click here okay and i will be for that i'll click here river and um, previously creating bar bending schedule you have to design that beam so if you new here you can watch our previous lecture from given playlist okay in that playlist you will get every lecture part by part so come here bvs then river tag manager so from here if you want that you can create that okay if you want that you can create that so uh, for bar bending schedule just see here the they have some things b1 okay number of uh, which types of beam this is the b1 then 25 nos 25 nos what is the meaning of that this is for our bottom reinforcement and uh, team is 10 okay team is 10 and again for uh, bottom for share okay for share here you are saying that you will see that notation and if you want to change that you can change from here as per your requirement suppose here uh, spacing at the rate of mm sorry uh, here see at the rate of one to zero mm like that you can uh, use that actually the data so i'll just delete i will delete that data okay and so um, and also from here you are able to use the data as per as per your requirement and what you need from here actually so from here you can select that so and for side reinforcement here this is the arrangement and also you can change that as per your requirement from here okay so i'll just cancel so uh, when it's done then I'll just click here generate BBS okay generate BBS bending schedule so simply click here generate BBS and from here you have to select the number of beam I mean for what beam you want to work so I'll just use wall beam I mean I will use wall beam for our uh, barbending schedule and for detailing okay from here for more detailing you can uh, change that data in our previous lecture also have showed you that okay so if you want to uh, change that then you can do that but i prefer to take it as default okay so i'll just cancel that from here actually what do you need what do you need for your barbenic schedule so um river numbering by element by a continuous okay so river notation river shape and a schedule format drawing or a spreadsheet so if you want to uh, create a spreadsheet then here you have to um, I mean for your schedule just you have to save if create a file so suppose ASD or SOCE then save okay so here in this file will be saved okay and after that click here simply generate so I'm clicking generate and uh, I have to wait for some time okay and it will automatically create our bar bending schedule for our that panel of beam okay so again i am telling you if you knew her you can watch our previous lecture okay and uh, from there maybe you will learn how to um, design a beam from e tabs to state rcdc actually this is a powerful and informative tools and uh, it will give you a great opportunity so here it's displaying bbs and also in excel also excel we just get our bbs just see here 
in Excel. Okay, so for every all of our for all of our bar, okay, for all of our bar, just see here we get our BBS in Excel. See here uh, the number of reinforcement required for bar here it's given for who is bar actually okay so i think it's okay in excel and also if we just come in rcdc just see here the bar bending schedule for uh, rcdc and uh, this is the bar bending schedule for b uh, 28 and also b 27 and just see here here is the bar okay and here is the total weight uh, so they have the total weight of our bar uh, 1577 kg for uh, 10 12 and 16 number bar okay so here wall bar are available i mean bar dia okay and uh, so here the total weight for that bar okay i mean for uh, that reinforcement actually in this way you are able to use these tools perfectly and also you can implement the tools um, directly to our i mean directly for our work okay so uh, thank you thank you for being with us and i hope you will be able to use that data perfectly for your work and if you need to modify that data then I, we have just created excel data here oh, i'm sorry so we have just created excel data here just um, by using that excel data you are able to use any types of work okay you are able to use any types of work here so this is for um, bbs this is for my sheet on and bar sheet so here uh, there are no bar sheet available no problem just bbs so um from here i hope you will um you'll be able to find out your data and also from that software and after uh, creating that data you can simply save that um, file from here so where is this file will save this file will save in dfx file i mean in autocad it will you'll be able to open that file in autocad okay so i'll, I'll create an extra video about that uh, after completing our total series that how we'll import all file to autocad uh, and so that we can uh, generate that file and we can edit that file perfectly without any problem so thank you thank you very much as well stay connected till next video and in our next video i'll show you that how we'll create how we'll create bill of quantity okay b o q for our that beam panel so thank you thank you very much still stay connected till next video and that was the um, shape and in this way just you have to design all of your uh, beam from etaps to state rcdc so thank you thank you very much still stay connected till next video